because once he hit that pole, they just went up in flames. A Jeep completely up in flames on the Ridgeway exit off 385. Everybody just started going in their car getting stuff to bust the windows. I would say we got to get this man out of his car. Witnesses say the Jeep was driving eastbound on 385 when he was sideswiped by another car, pushing him down a hill and into this pole. Moments later, flames came through the hood of the car. Find anything but a gallon of water. So I went back to try to wet him so if the fire got inside the car, maybe it wouldn't burn him as bad or keep him as moist as he could possibly be. They tried to find a fire extinguisher, but were unsuccessful. Moments later, a man ran over with a jack iron and broke through the window. Hey, we got to cut that Somebody go find something. Cut the seatbelt. He appeared to have been completely trapped in the driver's seat because the steering wheel was pressed up against him in the chest. Witnesses carried the man to safety, and moments later, loud popping noises came from the car. A noise, they say. They won't forget. The driver was taken to Regional One in non-critical condition, but a sight that brought tears to many was this Bible, the only thing left in a completely burned-up vehicle sitting on the front seat. So that is God. So if you don't believe, I don't know what to say.